their big 6'6", 325 pound nose tackle. He is not playing today. And you've seen that middle of the offense being attacked. And here he is throwing the football. Getting ready to. Every time we talked about Samson Evans. Better be careful. Watch out for it. You never know. Obviously, they, that was sniffed out a little bit by that Liberty defense. So Evans said, I'm just going to tuck it and get what I can. This should be nearly automatic. And it's good. And the Eagles take the early 3 to nothing lead after an impressive opening drive. But Shedra Lewis just laid a heck of a block. We'll see if we can get that replay when they slow down a little bit. They're going fast. Yeah, Lewis wants to do it now with his legs. Makes a man in the secondary miss, gets out of bounds near midfield. They'll move the chains. Willis to throw on first down. Oh, it's going down. deep. Has a receiver out there. It's caught. That's DJ Stubbs, and he'll score. 54 yards, and that deep ball is a thing of beauty. He's running full speed in stride, and you see the route. It's just a skinny post, and... You talk about throwing wide receivers open, and sometimes that gets lost on people. That's probably, what, four months old while that was being played? I was two, right around there. Yeah. <laughs> nice. That is a great yes. catch! Wow! Hassan Bedoun with an unbelievable catch over the middle. He was hurt for most of the year, came back right after the Toledo game, and had a breakout performance versus Ohio. He just, he has been really, really good. Had 127 yards Balls up in, in the that air. one and picked. That's going to be a score. Skyler Thomas. Right place at the right time. Takes the ball 26 yards for the score. All the momentum now with the Flames. You see Thomas, just a great job. Kind of played right in between the quarterback and running back. If that was a handoff or a pull, he would probably wouldn't have tackled anybody, but he did a great job of getting his hands up. With the left, too. Uh, the, you know, it, in slow motion, it looks like, oh, yeah, obviously he put his hand up. It, that is so hard to do coming full speed on a blitz. Start of the second quarter here in Mobile. Evans looking to throw. Now he'll just carry it himself and get the first down before being banged out of bounds. But Juwan Treadwell, they're going to want to move quickly. Evans again. This time he powers his way in. Wrap the ball up with two hands and lower your head, lower the shoulder. And if there's not guys around his legs... That's a big run. Inside the five, Green will score. 34 yards, and the Liberty Flames continue to burn this Eagle defense with big play. Second down and 10. Eastern Michigan in an unbalanced four by one set. Moss. Nice play, knifing in defensively. Drop Moss for a loss. That's Jalen Jimerson. Two yards on the loss. Couple of nice gains in the passing game. Now he may have a free play for Willis. He's going to try and go deep. That's a receiver out there inside of Eastern Michigan territory. And this time, C.J. Daniels makes the catch. And the flag will probably go the way of Liberty, so they won't have to worry about it. 39 yards. And But they've been relying on the running game to move them down the field, which I'm sure he's fine with. Now the fake to Green. Willis will again look to throw. Has a receiver wide open. Over the middle. That's Huntley, and he'll score. Do establish a good run game. You fake the run, and you're able to find a tight end leaking out uncovered over the middle. The linebacker sucked up on the run, and he found his big tight end, who's the active career leader for tight ends. Fewest in football. 46 today. Willis has time, has wow. a receiver wide open, that's his tight end, 25, 20, inside the 15, down to the 14, Trevor Hobbs, that's just his fourth catch of the year, and he makes the most out of it. Quarterback draw, mm. what a move by Willis, he'll score easily. Hit him with the hezzy and went right around for the end, for the score. See off the edge, 23. Oh boy. Hasta la vista, baby. Blake Bogan. They come with just four. Ooh, that oh, plays over. Yeah, yeah, plays over at that point. 
Saran Rush was able to bring the pressure. Aiden Alves will punt this ball away. That's a good kick. Driving Beidoun all the way back inside his 20, and he'll die inside the five at the one. The much maligned kicking game of the Liberty Flames. Bottom two, Pac-12, ACC. Correct. Shedro, look at that speed on the corner. Gets the first down before being banged out by Brandon Benson. You see, he, he's not going to step out of bounds. He wants to attack. He's a violent runner, even at that small stature. Willis has all kinds of time to throw. Now he's got a lot of room to run. 35, look at that speed, oh 15, goodness. and he'll score easily. <laughs> Once he got into the clear mark, he made that 35 yards look easy. I'm actually left-handed. Well, this <laughs> he is faster than that, and he, he had that burst right here, right here. He's like, ah, maybe I'll get caught. Nope, see you later. Really close into the end zone. And that was a time where there was really good coverage on the back end by Eastern Michigan. We're just focusing on kicking the football first, Chris. Boom, got it. And he made it. See, nice kick, man. Good snap, good hole, good kick. The offensive line coach coming out saying, hey, that, that's not all on the offensive line, which it never is. But I think this is a big game for that offensive line. And here goes Green again, another big play. He gets pushed out of bounds after a long run. And these two running backs are getting chunk plays now here in the second half. Willis will roll the pocket into the end zone. Caught for the score. Tamario Douglas just brought it in before the defender got to him, and the Flames increased their lead. For the ball to leave Malik Willis's hand and get to the wide receiver is remarkable. I mean, that ball is zipped in there, and the focus and concentration by Douglas to pull that one in for a touchdown. So they got all that just from Bryant looking over to the yeah, sideline. Let's see if it's right. They're right. Pressure comes up the middle. They'll get him. There's Story Jackson right there on the yeah, sack. Story was in on it. There he is. Look at that. What a moment. This transfer market, it's, it's really been beneficial for Liberty. Bryant, now chased out of the pocket. He's the one who's really been running for his life all game long. He'll turn his attention to the NFL, and now an opportunity to see who might be your starting quarterback next year in Jonathan Bennett. And he'll throw deep on first down and has a receiver oh, wide open. Wow. That's Kevin Shaw. Wow. He'll score. <laughs> Bennett just threw up the, yep, I guess, that's, guess I did it. That was easy. That was, wow. As we wind the clock down to about midway through this fourth quarter. Hutchinson looking to throw Ooh, pressure. He gets dropped. Hit. Trayshawn Clark. You know that had to feel good, right? Good snap, good hold, good kick. 18 in a row for Chad Ryland. It's already been a party on Bourbon Street, and now just let's walk on into the stadium. Fake to Henderson. Oh, that ball's intercepted. That might be six. Now that's going to do damage to his rating. Jeff Hubbard is going to score. He's thrown two passes and two touchdowns. Just one was for the other team. That's, that's, the, that's the unfortunate part, but... Job by Hubbard. Caden Salter, you mentioned his name earlier when talking about quarterbacks that'll compete for the starting job next year in there. And Henderson takes this one for a first down. Since exactly. this morning, Capital One Bowl Mania has been in effect. Salter under all kinds of trouble. And Jose Ramirez gets another sack. That's his seventh of the year. As they'll begin this drive in Flames territory. Mm, good cut. Good run by Moss. Ooh, that didn't that's, look good on his knee. That was a hard hit. Oh, it bounced up good, though. Well, that's good. Hutchinson will look to throw. It's Baydoon. <laughs> Coach Greg gets a Gatorade bath. Along with Hugh Freeze. And the Liberty Flames can celebrate their third straight bowl victory, 56 to 20. 
Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.